Hi Aquarius, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the entire month of May 2017. Also want to remind you guys that your weekly videos are up as well as your current week, so be sure to check those out. If you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. And if you're looking for a personal reading, please join me on my website. It is www.ms-swami.com. Aquarius, it doesn't look like a bad month for you guys, but one thing I want to say to you, and this is appearing more than once for Aquarius through the month, is don't let the temper get the best of you, okay? Uh, whatever temper flares up or whoever's provoking your temper, I'm going to describe that as brief in passing. Um, someone that you know is going to bring in some good luck of abundance or offer of assistance. Uh, there is some new money in the making for Aquarius. And it just shows overall, in general, you need to rethink your options. Now, granted, these are just general videos, but some of you, those options need to be made in the personal life. So, let's take a look. This is Aquarius for the month of May of 2017. Aquarius, we start with that Eight of Wands, followed by the Six of Swords, the Four of Wands, the Four of Pentacles, the Queen of Swords, and the Ten of Pentacles. So let me break this down for you guys. Moving forward, we start with that Eight of Wands. This is good energy around you guys. Um, and this is going to carry through for the most of the month of the month of May. This is victory. This is overall you feeling satisfied, contentment. In a good spot. Six of Swords shows that you are leaving your troubles behind. You are ready to embrace life. You are ready for change. Four of Wands is indicate total and complete happiness on the home front. Moving forward, we have the Four of Pentacles, we have the Queen of Swords, and we have the Ten of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles is sound financial decisions. One thing that jumps out in Aquarius I want to share with you guys. This is not a good month to lend money to those because it shows for a bunch of you that a lot of people have good intentions of repaying but just don't have the means to do so. And then we have that Queen of Swords. Now this could represent a man or a woman. Uh, this is in your personal life versus your work or career. And this is someone that has a sharp tongue that may get a little bit catty with you this month. Ten of Pentacles, this is something coming through in the financial sector. This is everything good financially. This is perhaps loans coming through, your tax returns coming in, something to that effect, but definitely strong month in Aquarius for finances. Moving forward, we have the Two of Cups. We have the Three of Pentacles, and we have the Five of Swords. Two of Cups, for my single Aquarius out there, this is a happy union. Um something new coming in, uh, things of that nature. For those of you that are coupled or married, this is good communications. That three of pentacles, not so much as financial stress, but I go back to saying, be careful of who you lend money to this month. Five of swords does not indicate obstacles, guys. It indicates that your defense is up. And, you know, and I'm going back to, I really think this is pertaining to family and for a lot of you is pertaining to your finances, but it shows the defense is really high this month. Now, what is odd, I have no major arcanas for you guys for the month. I am seeing the strong finances this month. I am seeing total victory and total happiness. And overall, for Aquarius, I can just say you guys are in a good spot this month. It's a great month just to kind of kick back, enjoy the ride, and enjoy. So, thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.